Well, the alert days are going to continue for the next couple of afternoons as this extreme heat continues here across South Mississippi. Right now out at Jones College, 95 degrees, but with the heat index, it feels like 110 out there at the moment. And it's 96 at Petro Nissan with a heat index of 106 this afternoon. So the humidity is really doing a big number on those uh, feel likes across the area. Mid 90s. That's what our current temperatures are. And this is what your car thermometer is going to show you. This is what the bank thermometer is going to show you. This is the actual air temperature, but it's the humidity that makes this making this heat wave so much worse. We got a lot of humidity in the air and that's making the heat index, which takes account for that humidity just skyrocket 105 106 still 110 heat index right now in Collins. So the heat's going to continue to bake us here across South Mississippi this evening. Temperatures will eventually fall back down into the mid 80s after the sun sets this evening, but it's still going to be a warm night across the area. Heat warnings in effect again for your day tomorrow for all of our counties. All, everybody is highlighted here under this excessive heat warning. So this is going to continue for your day tomorrow. And here's the reason why we start off tomorrow with temperatures right around 77. But look at this. We're going to climb up to at 11 a.m. 95. Again, 11 a.m. 95 degrees. You know it's going to be hot when before noon we're in the mid 90s. 100 is going to be the afternoon high tomorrow and it's going to be mostly sunny once again here across South Mississippi. Everybody should make it up to 100 degrees. And again, this is the air temperature. You factor in that humidity and it's going to feel like 109, 110, and we'll most likely see a few places getting up to 112, 113 tomorrow. And as you'll notice, that danger category with the heat index from 11 o'clock in the morning all the way to 7 o'clock at night. So a long duration of the day. Be sure to drink plenty of water, uh, take plenty of breaks if you got to do anything outside tomorrow because it's definitely going to be swelteringly hot. And unfortunately, this trend does not go away tomorrow. We're going to deal with it through Friday, Saturday and Sunday, but eventually we're going to see our temperatures going back down, but it's going to take a couple of days and then it'll happen just beyond the weekend. Saturday 99, Sunday 97, but relief is coming and I showed you this earlier, but I wanted to show you it again. The reason why the relief is coming is our heat dome breaks down and you'll notice by Tuesday we're back down to some of the cherrier reds, not this bright burny purple out here. That's signs that that heat dome is breaking down. And this is the best part. We go from 100 on Friday to 93 next weekend. Hard to believe saying 93 is a cool down, but in this case, we'll take whatever we can. And whether it's an ugly win, a pretty win, a win is a win. And you'll notice temperatures next week will continue to fall back down to the eventual low 90s. Uh, so that's some good news. Rain chances will return as well by the 4th of July. These are just going to be hit or miss daily rain chances. All right, Patrick, thanks. Southern Miss Baseball looks.